Hey there YouTube fam, welcome back to Sigma Male Perspective. Today we've got a fascinating topic to dive into, the intriguing comparison between Sigma males and Alpha males. We'll explore the key differences between these two archetypes that often dominate discussions about masculinity and social dynamics. In this video, we're going to explore the 10 crucial differences between these two archetypes, debunk some myths, and help you understand better these unique personalities. So if you're ready to gain some valuable insights, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and let's jump right in. Before we dive into the differences, let's briefly describe what alpha males are. Alpha males are often seen as dominant, confident, assertive individuals who tend to take charge in various situations. They are natural leaders, exude charisma, and are often associated with traditional masculinity. Now let's move on to Sigma males. Sigma males are a bit more enigmatic. They are often seen as lone wolves, introverted and independent. They don't actively seek leadership positions, but can excel in their chosen fields. Sigma males are often misunderstood, but they have unique strengths. Now, let's look at some of the 10 crucial differences. Difference number one, leadership style. The desire for power in alpha males is insatiable. His motivation is the desire for success, conquest and achievement, and he performs best when he holds a dominant position. Conversely, the Sigma male doesn't actively seek power, but he possesses the capability to rise to the occasion when thrust into a leadership role. While both Alpha and Sigma males inherently possess leadership skills, the Alpha actively pursues leadership roles, whereas the Sigma is often the one others seek out to assume such positions. Difference number two, social interaction. When it comes to social interaction, Alpha males are naturally drawn to the limelight. They thrive in larger social gatherings, often becoming the center of attention. Alphas are comfortable in the company of many people and enjoy networking, seeking out opportunities to showcase their charisma and leadership. On the contrary, Sigma males have a different approach. They tend to prefer smaller, more intimate social settings or even solitude. Sigmas are not necessarily shy or antisocial, but prioritize meaningful connections over the number of relationships. They often find solace in deeper, one-on-one -on -one interactions rather than seeking the spotlight in larger social circles. Difference number three, confidence. Alpha males radiate external confidence, readily expressing their self-assuredness in various situations. Their assertiveness, social dominance, and willingness to take the lead showcase their confidence visibly. Conversely, Sigma males exhibit a more introverted confidence. It's an inner strength derived from self-reliance and personal growth, often less apparent in their demeanor. While alphas seek external validation and thrive in social dominance, Sigma prioritizes self-assuredness in personal development over showcasing their confidence in social settings. Difference number four, work style. In the workplace, another noticeable distinction between alpha and sigma males emerges. Alphas tend to delegate responsibilities to their team members, asserting their authority as leaders. They may not always be open to input from those they perceive as socially inferior. On the other hand, sigma males lean towards collaboration within the team to address challenges and accomplish tasks. They actively seek out ideas and are willing to work alongside others, regardless of their social standing, to achieve common objectives. Sigma are more receptive to diverse perspectives and are eager to contribute their skills to help the team succeed. Difference number five, status and hierarchy. Alpha males and Sigma males display distinct attitudes towards status and hierarchy in social and professional contexts. Alphas are driven by a desire to climb the social and corporate ladder actively. They often seek recognition, authority, and higher status positions, valuing their place in the hierarchy. Conversely, Sigma males are less concerned with traditional status symbols and hierarchical structures. They prioritize personal fulfillment and even opt for unconventional paths that don't necessarily lead to a prominent social or professional position. For Sigma, inner contentment and pursuing their passions often outweigh the quest for external status. Difference number six, relationships. Alphas frequently seek out a large network of friends and have a tendency to have many social ties. They put more emphasis on having a wider network of friends and may not invest much time in each one. Sigmas, on the other hand, favor fewer, deeper partnerships. They value deep relationships, frequently developing partnerships with people who have similar interests and passions. 
Sigma focuses its time and energy on developing closer, more personal relationships as opposed to dispersing oneself thinly across a wide social range. Difference number 7. Expression of emotions Alpha males tend to be more open and expressive with their feelings. They readily share their emotions, whether positive or negative, and can wear their hearts on their sleeves. Their assertive nature extends to emotional expression, making their sentiments apparent to those around them. Sigma males, in contrast, are more reserved when it comes to showing their emotions. They often keep their feelings private, revealing them to a select few or during moments of profound trust. This doesn't imply a lack of emotions, but rather a preference for a more measured and a controlled emotional expression. Difference number 8. Risk Taking Alpha males are more likely to act impulsively or take risks. Even in high-stakes circumstances, their innate confidence and desire for dominance can cause them to act quickly. They frequently feel at ease with the risk-related ambiguity and may even view it as a challenge. Sigma guys, on the other hand, tend to take calculated risks more often. Before acting, they thoroughly consider the possible results and effects. Their independence and desire to keep control of their lives are a driving force behind this deliberate strategy. Difference number 9. Pursuit of Excellence As a gauge of their own superiority, alpha males frequently look for external confirmation and praise. They are motivated by a desire to overcome obstacles outside of themselves, compete fiercely to outperform others, and frequently thrive on recognition from others. Sigma males, in contrast, place a higher value on personal development and internal fulfillment as their standards of greatness. They are more interested in self-discovery and pursuing their passions than they are in receiving approval from others. Regardless of external praise or acknowledgement, their quest for greatness is frequently motivated by a desire for self-improvement and the gratification of mastering their chosen fields. Difference number 10. Personal Fulfillment Alpha males often find personal fulfillment in conquering external challenges and achieving positions of power or dominance in social and professional spheres. They thrive on external validation and recognition. In contrast, Sigma males seek personal fulfillment through self-discovery and inner peace. They prioritize their passions and personal growth, valuing fulfillment that comes from within rather than seeking it in external achievements or societal status. And there you have it, the 10 crucial differences between Sigma males and Alpha males. It's important to remember that these archetypes and real people can exhibit a mix of these traits. The key is understanding and appreciating the uniqueness of each individual. If you found this video helpful or thought-provoking, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and hit that subscribe button for more content like this. As always, let us know in the comments what topics you'd like us to explore in future videos. Thanks for tuning in, and until next time, keep growing, keep learning, and keep becoming the best version of yourself. Take care.